Very happy. Uh, we heard about about him at Columbus uh, with the MS uh, Next Pro, and he did great things. And I can't wait to to start the preseason to see how he's gonna work and what he's gonna bring to the team. We'll go to stay to our left on the back row, behind Jonathan. Daniel Foyerstein here. Um, obviously, before the season passed, you had Wilfred Nancy as your head coach. Do you feel maybe Courtois could be similar to him, or maybe he'll have different ideas for you for the upcoming season? Um, for sure, I think he's going to bring his his identity to to the club. Uh, for sure, he probably talked with uh, Wilfred Nancy before that, but I think... Uh, the new coach will will stick to to himself, and gonna we're gonna gonna bring his his own things and uh, try to make the best of the team. Any additional questions within the room? We'll take one via Zoom. This is kind of a follow up, Matthew, wanting to know what you think the biggest challenge will be facing your new head coach. Mm, I don't think it's a, a challenge really. It's just uh, how we're gonna adapt and and what it's gonna bring and us the players, how we're gonna adapt. Basically, that's it. And uh, and looking to the forwards, uh, to to the season. Sorry, uh, how he's gonna go into games? How we're gonna train? So that's it basically. Take our next question, Jonathan. Hi, Matthew. Jonathan Tannenbaum from the Philadelphia Inquirer. Um, I know there's been a big spike in season ticket interest uh, in Montreal this year. Some of the reporters up there have said Messi is part of that, which is no surprise. But still, you've been around the city for long enough. You know of the ups and downs of the teams over the years and what it's like when the team really, when the city really gets behind the team and packs that place. What would it mean for you guys and, and the team and the other guys who are from Quebec to make a bit of a statement and show to those fans who are coming in that maybe they ought to stick around? Yeah, um, I think we need to be more consistent and it will be a big challenge and throughout the season and the, f the fans in Montreal are amazing and they're always behind us and it will be great to do a, a great season and bring joy to the fans, bring joy to the city by making the playoffs and maybe win a trophy this year. We'll take a next, another question via Zoom. Um, the team had a lot of young players break into the starting 11 last year and will look to play, um, who will look to play a key role. How, is ex how exciting is it to see so many young players leading the club like yourself? Uh, it's very nice from myself coming from the academy and all the other guys. I think that everybody who's young in Montreal has a chance to play and show himself. So it's very nice coming to the pitch and uh, have, having all this conf confidence from the club that you can do mistakes, you can do whatever you want on the pitch and just be yourself and express yourself the best as possible to grow and to, to achieve your dreams. I want to thank you for your time today. Thank you.